What's going on everybody, David here. The most frustrating thing about video editing and, and for me, the most frustrating thing was if you shoot, let's see, two, three different camera angles, then you get all these video tracks and audio tracks and you don't know how to synchronize everything together and you're trying to follow the little peaks on the audio to, to set it all up and it's just frustrating. So um, the I, I, I will show you guys right now an easy way to do this. It's really simple. Uh, basically all you do is you grab a file. So I have a video track here in my project window. I'm going to go ahead and grab, grab it and drop it here. Let's put them right up. There we go. And then now I have another video and audio track. So I'll just grab that one, put it over the top. And so now I have all the files and they're all together and we have two tracks. Okay, so now if I had a third track, a third video and audio track, I can drag it over the top. You have to have an audio track with the video track in order for the in order for Premiere Pro to recognize and synchronize them together. So I like to offset them. I don't like to have them right next to each other. Offset them a little bit. That way, when I do, when the once it's done, the synchronize once it synchronizes the video and audio, you'll be able to see a move and you'll know that it's done. So let me show you really quickly how to do it. If you have it unselected, just uh, left click and drag over all all the uh, footage, and then you're going to right click. And when you right click, you're going to have the window that this window opens up, and you have this button here that says synchronize. All you do is click it and you don't have to worry about any of these up here the synchronized points you just want it to say audio here and then you're going to click ok and it will work and then there it is now it's synchronized everything together so these tracks are all synchronized so if you play back it's going to play back all together so that's that's the goal that's what you're trying trying to accomplish there e, so now right under the beauty of this is you can clip the ends here so i know i can clip these ends because that's nothing there so now we have that track there and clip the ends back here and now we have the footage here and if we look closely you can see that it's pretty much identical so you the first thing is you have to have both video and audio on both of your on both the tracks that you're using and once you've done that then you're you're set to go so now i know already that this this video or this audio here is the one that I want to keep. I don't want to keep this audio. And it's a good practice to only use one audio. You can use both, but it sometimes it yeah, it sounds a little weird. So what I want to do is I want to get rid of this this video, this audio track, but I want to keep the video track. So what I'll do is if I select on it again and I right click, the when this window comes up again and this button here says unlink. That's what I want to do. I want to unlink it. And then I can just click separately on the video and the audio track. So now that I've clicked the audio track here, just click delete, and there you go. There you go. Now you have video. You have two video tracks here and one audio track. And it's always best, just so you don't mess up your the synchronization, to first off click on this one, click on the top one, right click. You want to unlink it. So now everything is unlinked. So you can individually click on each of these tracks then left click highlight everything then right click go up to link and now I've linked everything together so when I move them they all go together so that way I'm not gonna lose the I'm not gonna separate the audio from the video and that's very important especially if you have a lot of tracks in one uh, you're editing and you have a lot of tracks together and then you move one and you move it off just a little bit and now you're your video and audio is all uh, unsynchronized. So that is it. That's all I have for you guys. Please give me a thumbs up if you like the video. Please comment if you have a question. Please subscribe for more, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.